Who uses TF's money? I do. No. Get, get away from TF's money right now. No, no, there's two, so, there's two websites. Yeah, so, uh, CS money, uh, now what they, they have is someone made a scam site, but it's the same exact link, and it's an HTTPS. It's, uh, csmoney.cs money. Yeah, I know. No, it's literally just called cs.money. Like, you can type in cs.money and you'll be redirected to the scam site. But what it is, is it's JavaScript, which what JavaScript is, is it can have hidden text in the URL that you can't see. That's why you always uh, do control U and you check the URL. But no one's gonna look for that. Just you want to stay away from CS money until they fix it or get rid of it. So I would say stay away for a few more weeks. I recently, okay. I recently lost a knife because of this. They make you deposit. So if it says you need to deposit in order to uh, it. use it, decline it because they're scamming you. They won't give you anything back, and the only items that are in their so-called trade bots are items they've scammed from people. Yeah, and I got my, uh, uh, well, good thing I didn't have my knife on me that day, because I let someone use it, and, uh, I had a, a $20 scan, and I was like, fuck. Oh, you guys want to hear a funny scam story? So, I was pretty new to CSGO, this was a couple of years ago, and, um, I, I got, like, this 50 cent skin from a friend that gave it to me, like, a good friend of mine, and a day later, this guy hits me up, he's like, hello, bro. You want to trade CSGO skin? And I'm like, what, what's going on? Uh, sure, sure. And he's like, alright, I will give you $20 Steam gift card for CSGO skin. Yes. And I'm like, wait, but my skin's 50 cents. That's about 50 times overpay. Which is, that's about $19 overpay. So I told him that, and he said, don't worry. I just want to get rid of this gift card, my friend. So... Uh, I started to play along, and whenever he sent the offer, he was like, just accept the trade and I will give you the gift card. And, um, he, he kept on asking me to accept it, but I kept on declining it and saying an error happened and that I'll resend the trade. And I kept on doing this to the point where he thought I was a scammer, and he called me a scammer. And I told, I sent, I was gonna send him... I was gonna send him proof, and the proof I sent him was a picture of Bill Cosby, and then he blocked me. I sent him a picture of Bill Cosby. You always want to troll them before they block you, am I right? Yeah, you want to waste their time so they can't scam others. <laughs> 